You we know? have some social media questions. All right. Brian Tanner on Twitter. Do you think music shapes and informs culture, or does culture shape and inform music? Music has the power to shape and inform culture, and, and that is uh, something that I think many artists should be aware of as, you know, they go through, you know, I was talking to Don Letts. Don Letts is a guy who directed all the music videos for The Clash. Um, he did some stuff for Bob Marley and what have you. He's a music video director. And uh, he spoke to me and said, you know, we used to make music to, to break the system. Now we make music to be a part of it. And for me, it's crucial that we realize the power of music as we create it so that we can shift the national discourse. So I believe that music has that power. Whether that power is utilized is another question. At Get G says, Saul, you're a genius. Do you, do you have a muse? <laughs> of course I have a muse. Yeah, her name is Anisia Uziman. When you say of course, everyone should have a muse? Well, I mean, uh, the muse is in music, is it not? <laughs> I mean, it's, it's, it's you know, I, it's, I don't know if the muse always has to be singular, you know? Okay. In my case, yes, I have a muse. Um, but inspiration is, is, is there to be had, and it's, it, yeah, so. At Gigahoot on Twitter, what forms of teaching do you love most for your children? <laughs> uh, by example. At Earbound Sounds on Twitter, what was it like working with Trent, Re Trent Reznor during Niggy Stardust, and will there be a follow-up? Uh, working with Trent, uh, Trent is is a beautiful, uh, you know, extremely creative and talented musician um, who, for me, uh, really served as a sort of confirmation of a lot of musical ideas I was having because I would share them with him and, and he would immediately be like, this is awesome, oh my God, let's, you know, and so it just made me feel good. Um, and we didn't always have to communicate a lot because we could just share musical ideas. Will and there be a follow-up to Nicky Stardust? Uh, possibly, I have no idea. And one other question, Corey Anderson on the Larry King Now blog, what's next for Saul Williams? Uh, right now, I'm working on the graphic novel and the film for Martin Luther King. Watch new episodes of Larry King Now, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, on demand on Aura TV and Hulu.